Back up. Gotta get that thumbnail. Gotta get that thumbnail. All right, Craigslist find day number three, four, five, whatever it is. Let's go look at some uh, cars. Also, Cruz is gonna sell his mint condition 1998 Toyota Tacoma. I'm just kidding. What is it, like a 2010? God, they made these cars like so backdated when they made them. <laughs> um, he's gonna sell this to some guy hopefully today. So we're doing that, we'll be around in San Jose and then we're also gonna go look at an FDRX7 to see if I ever wanna buy one. A Z06 and maybe an FRS if we fucking deal with that, I don't know. Otherwise, we're just gonna do some hot boy shit today and go find some cars. Look at this fucking thing, dude, this thing's ridiculous. We gotta sit on my trunk and eat a burger off of it. <laughs> <laughs> and then the muff's on here. Fuck the muff, dude. Look at this goddamn car. Jesus Christ, that's legit. It's it looks so nuts the wing. I need a car with a wing. <laughs> Just for no reason. No fucking reason at all. Wow, that looks sick as fuck. Get the get up there. Wait, 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 come back, you fucker. I want to see this coupe. Mike, come. All right, so I'm gonna be like, thanks for the cash. All right, I'm gonna give you cash on the check. <laughs> So, Peruz just sold this truck, which is fucking awesome, um, and he's gonna go get the Tundra in a minute, but here is Viet's FD. So, pretty fucking uh, cool car. It is very old, it is very clunky, it is very rough, but it is cool. Um, I gotta be honest, though. The dirt's from like 30 years ago. The dirt's from 30 years ago. So he has two of these, and I'm thinking he probably used this one as his like parts car, but it's it's rough around the edges, but it's clean. I mean, like, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I just went for a ride with him in it. He only has a base tune on it, or like a, not a base tune, he has more of like a um, like a base map on it. So it breaks up after four pounds of boost. So he can't really do much more than that. Can't really drive it too much, which is kind of annoying, but it's whatever. At least I can get a feel for what it was like in there. Like sitting on the inside though, it's, it's like a little tiny for me, but it's, it's cool. Do a little walk around on it. I think it's on stock suspension too, so that's why it's like sitting a little higher. And then it's HKS muffler, but it's clean, man. Cool little FD. They're, it's actually a lot smaller than I thought it would be in person. And here's interior. So, yeah, I mean, you know what doesn't work for me though, being my height, is like sitting in this with the stock steering wheel. My knees like pretty much hit this here. So I'd have to like throw a Nardi on there or throw a different seat that's just a little bit lower. Um, but yeah, it's pretty much all stock. It's like a Grady boost timer and just needs a tune. I, the glass almost broke when I threw it right there. HKS sounds kind of good. It's not. This is like it's like a battle. It's like a battle with. Is the FD get clutch in? No, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know what to do because I'm not buying anything today. Obviously, right? We know that. I'm gonna see the Z06, but if I'm gonna pair up this '93 FD, which is no no offense to him, it's a bucket. It is like. It's on stock suspension, but dude, it feels like it's on cinder blocks rolling around. Like, it is the clunkiest thing on the planet, and there's so much stuff everywhere. It's and definitely I know, 30 years old. I, I know, it's 30 years old. It's, it sucks. It's like, for the same price, right, you go and you get a Z06 that makes 15 times the horsepower. It also could be like a Canyon track rat. I don't know. It's kind of, it's like, gee, thanks. Thanks. How can I? Someone's always interrupting. It, uh, it just doesn't Dude, make... the other day, I was Oh, fuck you, dude. <laughs> It just doesn't make any sense to, I don't know, man. It, it, I have to say like a really clean, like maybe even an LS swapped FD to, for it to make sense. But that FD right there, without even like being able to run anything past a base map, he has it up for 20K. And the thing is, somebody's probably gonna buy it around that price. I, bro, I wouldn't even feel comfortable like spending 12K because I know how much work it fucking needs. It just, it would hurt in general. So yeah, I don't know. I think I gotta rule the FD out. Love them, but it's gotta be way cleaner than that. That's. 
It, that's funny, they're right there too. And they're probably gonna watch this video because there are RX-7s in it. No offense to you, bro. Like, this is not, nothing against you. It's just the car is just old, you know? I had to see what I was getting into. Um, maybe if it was like fully tuned and I could have ripped it a little bit and it was on coils, it would have been better, but I don't know. Yeah, I gotta pass right now. I gotta pass. All right, back at the dealer because this guy just, well, here's what's funny. This dealership <laughs> fucking offered him five grand. Put your phone down. There's a cop there. <laughs> <laughs> Drops it <laughs> and have it on video. This dealership offers five grand. Oh my god, watch this person with their fucking doors. Jesus, this is like a second person. Oh my god, person. Holy shit. <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. Anyways, this dealership, bags of dicks, offer him five, <laughs> offer him five grand for his truck. When it's like you could probably private private party sell it for like a little, a little over seven. And then he found this guy in San Jose that's gonna come up and meet us at the dealer right now that's buying it for 6,800. And like when we were about to leave the dealer, he goes, hey, wait, 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 5,500, 5,500. And I was like, dude, fuck that. Let's just go make an extra 1,300 and then you can apply it towards the Tundra. So now we're gonna try and lowball this dick bag for this Tundra, get him down another 28. And if we get him down to 28, maybe even a little lower, then I will cut out all of this stuff where I'm bad mouthing this dealer <laughs> and we'll uh, get a Tundra for a good price. All right, Tacoma, Tacoma, it's hella blue, and it's just too small. These cars are, these trucks are just, they're not full size, they're too small. However, the sand color is beautiful, but if you guys want to see it, there it is. Ahead, Bam. Where is it? Tacoma's done? What? Tacoma. Uh, he's going to come here. Hold it. There it is. This thing is damn pretty. Oh, it's a beautiful truck. It's a really nice send up to you. Not bad, huh? Not bad. All right, so it's actually pretty clean. I'm not ever a fan of like the, the half door here. I always want like a full door, but no bullshit. It, the back seat's actually not that, not that like small. I fit back there, which is, I'm probably gonna be the, one of the biggest people are gonna put back in the truck. Um, but dude, this is clean. It's such a clean truck. Full size bed too, like six and a half foot, I think. Um, this is the one to get. And one owner, it was bought, or it was leased then bought, and it's super clean. Check this out. Look at that. Mint. Yeah, no, I mean, they, they really take care of it, too, so. It is a sweet truck. 60,000 miles. What is it, 2015? 2016? Yeah, the back seat actually is a good size. That's a big LCD. What kind of camera is that? Uh, no, it's Black Magic. It's a film camera. Holy shit, man, it's big boy stuff right here. Look at that. Finance. Okay, write down your social security so I can show it to everybody. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, Jesus. This guy goes and sells his truck outside and just starts pulling out fucking paper and just flexing like Fuck an it. idiot. Dude. Fuck it. I tell the funny, the dealer wasn't even we gonna... Have one of those supreme, the like, dealer wasn't even gonna offer you this money. fucking much money and you went and sold it in front of the dealer for like two grand over what they told you they'd offer you. <laughs> Alright, here is the just 2020 you didn't work Supra. Just I'm gonna come here every day and be like, don't buy cars from me. Just bug this guy. Here's the 2020 Supra. It's pretty, pretty, pretty sweet, actually. Um, in, I would say in person, it's way better looking than it ever looked in pictures. The only thing I wish is that that, that A pillar was painted white, not black. I don't like the whole wrap around panoramic looking window. But city. I should have the papers and be next to this. Gotta get that thumbnail. <laughs> Got What's super dope about this too, though, is like the hips on it actually look really good in person. I love the rear end. So <laughs> yeah. I love this thing. I, I want one. All right, this is what it looks like on the inside. Super pretty. Super pretty. Is it gauge cluster? The gauge cluster is so nice. I'm gonna sit inside this thing. I have to. I saw it. Do it. All right, here it is in the car, and it's it's such a good fit too. Like it's so comfortable in here. The dash is legit. The screen's sick. I don't care if it feels like a BMW. It's fucking legit. Park button press, little tuner knob. Oh, I got radio already. No, it probably will, but look at the look at the nav. Oh, geez, the air is on. What is happening? I don't know. Everything's coming on. Turn it off. In here, though, like my camera's not wide enough. It's like such a cool feel, and it has two, just two seats in here, 
I thought it was like had back seats, right? Like sports seats, but it's a straight up roadster and a huge area for like hatch room back there. What a great car. This car is so cool. Gonna go look at the real car now. The one he actually bought. It's not. Thanks, man. <laughs> All right. This is actually what he bought. So here we are. There you are with no mask. All right. Boom. You're good. It's a video. The whole thing's a video. <laughs> sick. This car's truck sick. The paint is so clean. It's taking us seven fucking hours though. We'll stand outside it. Close the door. Stand outside and close the door. Does it look like butt? Stop posing, fucking homo. Jesus, I'm just taking this thumbnail. All right, lit. Big old man purchase right here. He ended up getting a fucking Tundra 2016, 2017, 2020, whatever the fuck it is. I don't know. It doesn't really matter at this point. It's new. Hell yeah. Banging ass truck, and it's so big. Now I have my own fucking room over here that I have to sit in this shitty little old single cab fucking Tacoma that lasted him forever. Hell, bro, we clutch kicked the living shit out of that car. <laughs> he, you remember the video where he ripped off the tailgate and threw it on the fucking field? Jesus, man, that car got beat to hell and just abused, and now he's rolling in the super daddy tundra. So here we go. Let's fucking get it.